Today is Super Bowl Sunday, and when I was at church, when I used to go at the time, I remember these group of girls when the 2016 Super Bowl halftime show came. It had uh, Bruno Mars, and it had some guy um, with a piano that I remember, and... Um, what I remember was is that they were playing worldly music and the Super Bowl was obviously played during the when we were at church at like youth or excuse me it was on Sunday night and we all like all of us youth people watched it and I remember these group of girls when Beyonce came out with with like tights on and then um saying whatever she was saying singing whatever she was singing and here it is, a group of girls screaming and chanting for Beyonce and saying, yes, queen. I just came to realize now, well, obviously I realized then, but obviously, or I didn't know it then, but obviously, not infallibly now, but I just got reminded that by the Lord that we need to be the Lord Jesus' idol. He must be our king. He must be our God. Not Beyonce, not Bruno Mars, not women who stands up for this kind of people or that kind of people or what or anyone in the world. Not to say hate people like the world hates each other and loves each other in vanity or van or vain. You also have to love, but also be rebuking at the same time. Obviously, then I was a teenager, and I and most teenagers care about what others think. And I just want to just plainly say that we should not be going after celebrities. We should be going after Jesus. And most people will hate you for it, and will despise you, and will say all kinds of things. But don't worry, because even if you're the only one standing for Jesus and you truly follow after him and obey him, then you will be saved unless you strive to the very end of your life. May Jesus bless you.